bande ego ego igande ha ego gwandu dana he ego igande I'm Danny Paul from Member Two. I've uh, been dancing traditionally for 45 years now, almost 50 years, and uh, it's it's something that's really important to me to be able to uh, uh, express myself through dance. But there, every dance to me um, is all traditional. It doesn't matter. There's you, you can't categorize dance. I don't think because dance is the the expression of an individual that wishes to uh, pray this way or honor. Uh, certain songs hit you inside. They hit your core. It'll send a shiver right up your spine, and the energy you get from that is incredible. And then you know. That, to me, is my ultimate form of prayer and acknowledgement of uh, who I am as a Onu. And when you uh, perform that dance, you're taking on that attribute of that particular animal or bird. And you're, you're mimicking what they're doing the best way you can to show respect for that animal or that bird. When we honor the drums, we, we put tobacco on all the drums before we dance. We put tobacco on the sacred fire before we dance. As a way of acknowledging our ancestors who have passed this way on to us. And, and it's our responsibility and duty to ensure that these ways are carried on. And the only way to carry it on is to have our young people involved with it today so that they understand uh, the significance of what it what it means to be uh, a, a dancer or a drummer, and uh, as all new people, uh, we're usually a, a shy, reserved, not in the reserved sense that we're on a reservation, but uh, more or less like uh, concerned about our way of life and. This is the only way I understand that uh, allows us to express freely who we are. 